Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video with Swaggle Haas. And in this video, we got some breaking news. We got to talk about this record comic book sale. Uh, this is something that has been kind of a long time coming for this year, but an amazing Fantasy 15 in a CGC 9.6 just sold a couple hours ago for a record $3.6 million. That makes this the most expensive comic book ever to be sold in the history of comic books. And to me, this is pretty cool. This is really, really awesome, exciting news. I feel like this is very fitting. Obviously, uh, Amazing Fantasy 15 is the first appearance of Spider-Man. To me, Spider-Man is the premier superhero in all of comic books. Uh, you know, you compare them to the likes of like the Batman and the Superman. And for, you know, a long time, Batman and Superman have kind of been, you know, higher in sort of the tier list. But I feel like uh, in recent years, Spider-Man has surpassed them as the, you know, most recognizable superhero. And I think that this, you know, sale right here kind of speaks volumes to that. Now, granted, this is a 9.6 CGC uh, that hit this number compared to some of the other comic books uh, for first Batman, for Superman that are lower grades. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's hard to compare the numbers exactly. Uh, but, you know, I just kind of wanted to let you guys know that this happened, kind of go over the news, go over this article right here that I have on Bleeding Cool, and we'll just kind of go through it and, and talk about this. I mean, this is pretty, pretty insane. So uh, you can see here, a stunning copy of Amazing Fantasy 15, CGC 9.6, has set the new record of $3.6 million at Heritage Auctions uh, earlier today. Uh, that's an all-time record price paid for any comic book, surpassing the $3.25 million paid for an Action Comics number one, CGC 8.5. So an Action Comics number one, of course, is the first appearance of Superman, one in an 8.5 sold earlier this year for $3.25 million. Now, there are higher grade copies of Action Comics that actually do exist. Uh, so it would be, you know, it, it's not to say that uh, the Spider-Man is officially uh, the most expensive comic book. Uh, you know, maybe if a higher grade Action Comics were to go on sale today, uh, that would actually surpass uh, the number we just got, but you know, still a, a significant milestone to hit, uh, being that it, it it did set the all-time new record. Uh, let's see here. So the first appearance of Superman set uh, was in April earlier this year. Uh, there are only four copies that exist of a CGC 9.6 Amazing Fantasy 15. Uh, so, you know, there are three other people out there that do have uh, instantly $3 million in the bank for themselves. Um, but, you know, again, here you see it right here, 9.6 Amazing Fantasy 15. I mean, look at this copy right here. This is a beautiful, beautiful copy. I mean, can you imagine like what, like what's wrong with this thing? You know, I, that, this is what I want to know. Like what, what prevents this from being a 9.8? Uh, I got to give a shout out to uh, Neo Comics on Instagram. He made a good joke. He was talking about like, oh yeah, you know, 9.6. So uh, crack, crack and press and resubmit. You know, let's see if we can get that 9.8. Uh, but th that would be amazing. You know, if if uh, that actually did happen, someone actually decided to to crack this book and uh, try to regrade it. But beautiful copy, uh, looks flawless. I mean, it's it's crazy to think that like copies like this exist. They almost don't look real. You know, when they're so new and pristine looking, uh, but but pretty amazing overall. Uh, the article goes on to compare to like some of the other uh, things that happened this year with the comic book market. Obviously, a Batman number one, CGC 9.4, sold for $2.2 million also earlier in the year, uh, this being the first appearance of the Joker and first um, Batman solo title. So that's pretty significant as well. And then I also covered this on the channel uh, earlier this year, a Marvel Spotlight number five, a CGC 9.8. This one sold for... Uh, Two hundred sixty-four thousand uh, dollars, as far as like setting a record for a Bronze Age comic book. So the most expensive Bronze Age comic book ever to be sold is this first appearance of Ghost Rider here. Uh, but the most expensive comic book ever, Amazing Fantasy fifteen, just set the record earlier this morning, nine point six, um, three million six hundred thousand. Pretty hefty price tag. Uh, makes a lot of sense though. I mean, I felt like everybody kind of predicted that this was going to be the book that would set the record. And, uh, it, you know, it feels very, very fitting uh, for that reason. But, you know, that is really all I have for this video. Just kind of wanted to do a short video kind of updating you guys on this news. Uh, let me know what you guys think. If you guys had your copy, if you were one of the other three uh, collectors right now that had a copy of ASM 15 at a 9.6, would you guys be putting your book on the market uh, knowing that you can get... Uh, 
3, 3.6 million for it. Uh, it's pretty crazy overall. Uh, but it does, you know, kind of beg the question a little bit. You know, I'm, I am interested uh, later on to do a video that kind of talks about uh, heritage auctions and a lot of the sort of shenanigans that are out there in the video game, uh, graded video game seller space. Uh, a lot of talk of market manipulation. Uh, this one I think is interesting because up until a couple of days ago, there were actually a few bids on this comic book. So it's insinuated that more that there were that there was people that were bidding this thing up. Uh, whereas the action comics. A comic book. There was only one bidder, and similarly on the uh, the Ghost Rider, the first Marvel Spotlight Five, there was only one bidder on it. So uh, it's interesting to talk about you know market manipulation and and see if these sales are are actually happening. Uh, this is one that you know I tend to believe. I think that there probably is someone out there who's you know super rich and would love a copy first appearance of Spider-Man uh, and be willing to pay, you know, a few million for it. I mean, if you're Jeff Bezos and you like Spider-Man, you know, why wouldn't you just park your money in a comic book collectible like that? Uh, so I think that that's probably, um, it's probably an accurate number, probably really did happen. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll, have a, we'll have a discussion about, you know, the uh, market manipulation stuff and the shill bidding uh, in a future video later on down the line. But until we do, this right here is the record for the most expensive comic book ever to be sold. Amazing Fantasy 15, CGC 9.6, $3.6 million. Pretty crazy if you ask me. Anyways, that's all for this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, would you pay this uh, amount of money if you had it in your... Anyways, I'll see you in the next video.